My friends, it's your old pal Jordan the Lion. How are you all doing today? I hope you said great. We are gonna have fun today. We are in Myrtle Beach and we are at Broadway at the beach. This is their kind of boardwalk area. And I came over here last night and noticed some really cool stuff and I wanted to share it with you today. So days with Jordan the Lion, you all in Myrtle Beach, it begins right now. They've got their Christmas theming out and I loved coming over here because just a big wave of nostalgia hits you. You have the Hollywood Heroes and Villains store right here. There's a vintage collectible store a little further down the way. You gotta love this fountain. Showing the community enjoying it. Stashes of people just hanging out. Then look at this. It's like a freaking who Christmas, Whoville Christmas. Hey, there's Frosty. See, so you can even take a family photo in here in front of all the packages and presents. Oh, and by the way, welcome to South Carolina's number one destination. Hello, Tiki Jim. Take a look at this, they actually have a magic shop in here gotta love that and I noticed a familiar friend standing inside as soon as I looked in there so let's go say hi Zoltar I thought that was you how the heck are you let's see what Zoltar has to say hear your fortune from Zoltar Ah, yes. It looks like today must be your lucky day, for I see relaxation in your future. Have no worries about your troubles, my friend. Zotar has wisdom enough to conquer them all. Surrender to me your treasure, and let me tell you more. All kinds of crazy fun stuff in here you can buy. <laughs> all the usual cool gag gifts, but then you can also buy no tear toilet paper. Have fun with that. I have to always appreciate any time I see dinosaurs out in the wild. I always mention it. I always stop and film them. <laughs> I love it. And they happen to be right directly in front of Christmas at the beach. Just look for the Santa Claus with the sunglasses and you'll be here. Wow, this is Christmas heaven. Take a look. Isn't that amazing? Definitely is Christmas at the beach for your mermaid ornaments. College football, Christmas tree. It's all ornaments of, of course, college football teams. It says, beware, a Grinch lives here. Oh, Santa. Doesn't that look great? Going to their upstairs. All right, let's go see some of the other stores that I saw that I think you'll enjoy. Who's a little curious about what's inside Tiki Jim's? I know I am. And I know it's gonna be good because you have a gigantic totem pole in here as soon as you walk in, so that's always a winner. Probably all beach wear. Oh wow, you can buy ukuleles. The front counter is set up like a tiki bar. And yes, ukuleles galore. Oh wow, they're selling Johnny Depp shirts. <laughs> a mega pint or is it happy hour anytime? Wow, look at all the crazy sunglasses. I like the theming. Look at like the burning flames up there. And the Elvis mugshot shirt. I've never owned one of those, maybe I'll get one of those. It says foosball legend, Bobby Boucher, Adam Sandler. And then check these out. Look at Spicoli. Tasty waves and a cool buzz. Oh, look at that, a fun pick opportunity. Fun pick opportunity, stick your head through there. <laughs> but what I really wanted to show you 
the main thing that I saw yesterday, I was like, oh, this is so awesome, I have to bring everybody tomorrow, is right over here. I came by last night and saw this, and I was like, what the heck? They got a whole Simpsons theater over here. They have a Simpsons 4D ride that uh, you can take. It's, you know, it's got the uh, video screen that makes you feel like you're on a roller coaster. And it just looks so amazing lit up at night. But I love it when you go over here, look who's working the ticket booth. Familiar, trusted face. <laughs> Gotta love Bart Simpson with all the cash. But this, this was awesome. I saw Quickie Mart, you know, I loved the show. It's still on, but man, when you watch it now, it's a lot different. <laughs> I never noticed how many sexual connotations there are in so many episodes, but I, uh, I love the show. And of course, Apu worked here at the Quickie Mart. So I went in there thinking, ah, it'll probably be just like a couple Simpson things or very generic stuff. This is actually a really cool spot because they have a lot of kind of like Easter egg type stuff. Stuff from specific episodes. So let's go check it out. And yes, you can get a squishy. And you gotta love the irony of the humor here. You have Chief Wiggum over here eating a donut, looking out the window. And right around the corner, the kids are harassing poor little Millhouse. <laughs> Jimbo Jones and Nelson threw his squishy down on the ground, they're laughing, ha <laughs> ha! You gotta love it. Gotta love the humor of it. So let's go on in. Enjoy this, my friends. Welcome to fun. You're welcomed immediately with Quickie Mart. Welcome, Matt. And look at all the fun stuff in here, man. Wow. See how cool is that? Bartman. All the various superhero configurations you'll see throughout the show. Radioactive man down there. And they even did the backside of Chief Wiggum. <laughs> I love it. Now look at that. Action figures of all the memorable characters. McBain, Troy McClure. You might remember me from such hits as. <laughs> Those are great. Treehouse of Horror pins. Simpsons Igloo coolers, which are great because they're like the TV set from the intro. When you move it around, you get like a different different scenario. And I absolutely think I have to buy this shirt. You know I'm a shirt fanatic. Look at that. The brain freeze, look at his eyes. <laughs> Might have to get the shades too. And a quickie mark. Now you're on the beach, so everybody needs a fanny pack. Why not get a Bart Simpson or a donut? The pink donut one. Or even the Gilligan style hats. Have a little bit of everything. Bart on a skateboard. <laughs> Maggie. That is cool, look at the inside. It's the clouds from the intro. I love it. And then if you collect the Funko Pops, they have all of the, kind of the odd, Incarnations of the Simpsons. Majora instead of Marge. And I really love this. You can buy sunglasses of each one of the characters. Those Krusty the Clown ones are just unbeatable, aren't they? <laughs> oh boy, look at Ned Flanders. And if you like your novelty socks, they have tons and tons to choose from here. See when I said Easter eggs, this is one of them I was thinking of. I love this episode where they find out that Homer's like an idol <laughs> in like Japanese culture for like products. So I think I probably will end up getting one of these because I love that episode. All the crazy writing and everything of him. Speaking of Homer, nice beach wear. We start getting to the Duff section and they've got stuff for beer pong. <laughs> Duff ping pong balls. You've got Duff beer glasses. And over here, even a full cooler of Duff. A sparkling beverage. The Duff fanny pack. Duff koozies. You've got the uh, keep your drink cold. And then you've got a stuffed Duff and some really killer ceramic mugs. I mean, they've really kind of thought of everything as far as theming here. If you're a Simpson fan at all, you're going to find something here that you want. 
Lard Lad Donuts. Gotta love Lard Lad. Oh, by the way, you can buy donuts here. So right up by the register here, you'll notice they have the Lard Lad section. And yes, you can actually buy real oversized donuts with the Lard Lad logo on there. Or you can buy like a tiny one, smaller one to try. Genius. If you want to drink your beer out of a glass with Duff Man on it, you can. Or your own take home squishy container. And then same thing over here, you can buy all the Lard Lad t-shirts and if you want anything to uh, show off your love for the Simpsons and the donut, you can even get yourself a pillow. Of course you can get coffee here. You can get the Buzz Cola, the famous Buzz Cola from this show. And hot dogs. Even though they're advertising a Pooh's heat lamp dogs, and they don't have any right now. You actually, it's just because they're they're in the off season for the beach right now, so they will make you one if you want one here. They just don't have them pre-made right now. Now if you go straight on through to the back, they have a full squishy section. You gotta love it, you gotta love it. You can just imagine that scene we saw outside Millhouse <laughs> filling up his flavors. And let's see what the flavors are. Oh, nice, Radioactive Man flavor. You can see Milhouse filling his up just to get it knocked out of his hands when he goes outside. Oh, Mo! I would definitely, I think, get a freezing Mo orange cream. I think that's the, uh, that's what we'll do. Ah, I love it. You know me, I love theming of all kinds. All right, enough screwing around, let's get that squishy. I guess I could get Professor Frank's Super Sour Lemonade or Krusty's Cherry Cough Syrup. But I really feel like the uh, Freezing Moe's is the one I like the most. So let's do it. Whoops, a little bit of a mess. That's really good actually. That's really good, I like that. And then a full on duff section. The only thing they don't have here is something dedicated to Moe's. But you can get, look at that, can't get enough of that wonderful duff. All right. You can get yourself a <laughs> golf shirt like you work there. Yeah, I work at duff. You get the regular old t-shirt. You can get freaking duff earrings, duff shot glasses, duff beer glasses, duff frisbees for the beach, and even beach towels. And a squishy shirt. And here they have their gear for the Springfield Country Club with Homer on the logo. And also a Springfield Country Club golf towel. And these particular golf balls have the 4D experience on there with the Simpsons logo. Just when you think you've seen it all, they have games. They have Monopoly. They have code names. <laughs> they have puzzles. Lots of puzzles. And a really cool Quickie Mart Igloo cooler. They're kind of small though. Kind of like the size of a six pack. And I might have to get a Duff can for the road. Just for the heck of it. Awesome. <laughs> and if you want a bottled water, they even did that in the theme. Frostalicus. says, I have frozen myself so I may live to see the wonders of the future. Thaw me out when the robot wives are cheap and effective. P.S. Please alter my pants as fashion dictates. You got it, dude. But I got news for you. That Viking helmet will always be in fashion. And they always have magnets. You can always get magnets. Now that we've seen the entire store, we got to do the 4D experience. They're even playing Bart's album as we go next door to the theater. I love it. The experience, top notch. So you can get your tickets inside and come right on over here. And yes, I did buy a few things while I was inside. I got a Bartman shirt and some little nonsense like that. So on the other side of the theater, is actually all of this. We have a few minutes before the next showing. 
They thought of everybody. <laughs> what a, oh, Millhouse parents, what sad sacks. Worst dimension ever. Martin. The twins. Kent Brockman. Terrified of a cat. Here's good old Abe Simpson. Santa's little helper. Oh, you gotta love these two. Oh, guess who was here? Skinner stinks. Patty and Selma, right by the no smoking sign. I love it. And it's right here on the water, right across from Paula Deen's. Should be a lot of fun. And the guy working here did confirm what I expected. I can show pretty much everything going in, just not the movie or any of the movie itself. And they did tell me this is the only one they have of these anywhere. They're thinking of doing another one in Vegas, but this was the very first. All right, we're going in. Oh, wow. Take a look at that. Homer. Sideshow Bob hiding back here. They even have Ned and the boys in here. The creepy Mayor Quimby. The Skinners. Lenny. Oh, there's Mo. We'll go visit Mo. He's back here at the Aztec Wall of Fame, the Theater Wall of Fame. It's a picture of him and Maggie together. <laughs> Rainier Wolf Castle. Troy McClure, Krusty. So we'll be in here. Well, that was quite an experience. That was a lot of fun. That movie was great. And back in the Quickie Mart we go. So it was really an awesome experience. They show you two episodes and it's like the old Tingler experience where your seat moves if you were in the car and the car's turning, the seat would shift. If you ran over something like a bump or anything, there would be a bump in your seat. If someone threw something wet at someone else or spit, then water came at you. If Maggie walked through bubbles, bubbles came through. It was really, really a lot of fun. Um, they go into a, like a, a subway, Springfield subway system underground. And while that's rumbling and everything, your seat's rumbling. And I mean, it's pretty cool. You have like um, rats and stuff running under your feet and you could feel like air blowing through your feet. So. I highly recommend it. It's definitely worth the money. Here's the vintage house with a statue of Elvis and Marilyn out front. More souvenirs. I like the walls in here though. Look back there on that wall. The mural and little car and thing of Maryland. It's kind of cool. And if you work your way down here to the Ben and Jerry's, you can do the fun pick here. Pretend you're Ben and Jerry. Then check out behind the Quickie Mart. They have like a Viking ship here as well as some cool billboards on the back. really glad I came and experienced this today. This was a lot of fun. And being that it's the only one so far, totally worth it. Make your way to Myrtle Beach and check it out. Thank you all for watching. If you're new here, please hit the like button, please subscribe and ring the bell for notifications. Goodbye.